All right, you guys, welcome to the Noble L Show. My voice is coming back slowly. Um, you guys can join us on our new website, Noble L. You can join our email group at themollingsgmail.com. You can join our online tutor school class, and you can visit our two sites, our two YouTube channels, Noble L and Noble L the Second. Like, share, subscribe, you guys. Um, you can also email us. People share with us all the time. You can also email us for a uh, private email consultation. And for those of you in need of <clears throat> the GSA bonds and the 1099 OID to set off matters such as, well, the GSA bonds to set off matters such as child support cases, mortgages, foreclosures, ticket citations, utilities, auto loans. And we always try to tell you guys to see if you can go to your spouse or your former spouse and work out an arrangement with them first or, yeah student loans and warrants and for those of you having to see an agent doing business as parole officers as well as those of you in the churches doing business as jails for non-violent <clears throat> offenses you can email us at the mollies at gmail.com for the gsa bonds to set off set off set off the matters and the 1099 oid the 1099 oid 1099 oid to get back the finances they claimed you owed Remember to please, please, please support us here. Go to PayPal at themollingsatgmail.com. All right. There's a number of things that they just sent to us. Um, I want to thank uh, Mer I think it's Mercedes. Hang on. I want to make sure I got that right. Yes, it's Mercedes Dickerson. Thank you for this. And also to Divine Wisdom of the Seer. Divine Wisdom of the Seer was sending us some stuff about Russell Gould and the global financial reset stating that <clears throat> he's apparently responsible for it but i was thinking that what the angels are telling us here to find the wisdom of the seers unless it's an american indian war i don't see anyone else having that kind of power over um america morocco maghreb the north gate like it can't just be a european you know what i'm saying and that's the, the challenges the ancestors are having with russell gould there's no mention of the original indigenous people from him. You see what I'm saying? So unless you can send us a video where he's stating us, we can't use it. You understand what I'm saying? I know that the language was semantics. I know we were given other slave languages like English and what have you. That's why we speak our indigenous tongue here, right? So just to keep that in mind, that's why we haven't posted it yet. It's difficult even to watch it. It's difficult. We've watched a lot of Russell Gould. We don't have anything against him personally. We don't know him. All we're saying is that the ancestors are not guiding us to um, put him out front there because it seems to be the elders are more um, in control of that. Anyways, um, I want to thank Mercedes for this. Federally recognized tribes should be brace themselves for possible termination policy under Trump. Remember I was saying, you guys, that if you're a tribe, an American Indian, Moorish American National Pure tribe, I don't see how you could be federally recognized because you're under common law, common sense jurisdiction. You see where I'm going? Now, we did write to the Bureau of Indian Affairs to tell them that we as Rubenite tribe chiefs are here now and we use the 1968 Indian Civil Rights Act, but what we tend to do here is write an affidavit or write in the nature of discovery to the entities that we are um, we are guided to write to when we discover something new to have them rebut it and state to us factually to any more truth or anything um, that we've written that might be different to, to give them an opportunity to write back to us so far everything we've written to them stands as law truth fact when unrebutted right so in this video by torino oba shannon fl the cosmic titan he was talking about the american indians and how um in order for i think it was the lands he was saying that everything was put in trust now do you guys remember we had made a video about the Pazer Trust, and then we, people were talking about the Lucifer Trust, and there were all these other trusts that were created, I want to say, under the International Monetary Fund and the Global World Bank, right? Now, when we shut down the Pazer Trust on this channel to, by doing a public affidavit, it was later reported to us 
that they went after them because we had sent it off internationally that the Pazer Trust family or that group may in fact have committed mass high treason and genocide on us indigenous by so-called claiming everything on this so-called land and all the corporations, right? And then getting the profits, the tributes or whatever from those said corporations and bypassing all the original people. So we shut that down and then we had written privately and publicly to the international authorities that all the other trusts, the Lucifer Trust and all the other corrupted trusts, they also have to be shut down. Because why? They're not the original people on the planet. They're not the ones with the covenant. They're not the American Indian Moorish American nationals. So how can they have a trust here and claim anything to can go and trust? Do you see what I'm saying? That being said, you guys have to know, I think it was Larry King. They were recently talking about his trust and who was supposed to get what. I think his wife was fighting with his son over the trust, right? But even that, I think a lot of that stuff, that's why the insurrection, that's how the insurrection act kicks in, right? They were giving aid and comfort to the enemy, but in addition to that, they themselves were private agents claiming to be public governance. But we did not know that these celebrities, like Omar Sharif and them, when he gave an interview saying that, you know, he was going over and like he was representing whatever <laughs> politically, I thought he was joking. I didn't realize when these celebrities were traveling to China and all these different places that they were in fact representing like the, the people, right? You have to laugh, you guys, because when you think about the fact that these are actors, so these judges, these agents doing business, actors doing business as judges, we were taught, you guys, by our elders. Thank you to Grand Sheik, Taj Tariq Bey, who taught us never to apologize or say sorry. Eh? Never, ever, ever say sorry or apologize. Why? When you serve an entity, your truth, your facts and law, those stand unless unrebutted they stand they must rebut in under penalty of perjury with their full wet ink signature signed by a lawful judge or a lawful clerk with date stamp and seal when i say that you guys have to go back to the clearfield doctrine the 1861 coup d'etat all these agents when subject to using federal reserves or federal reserve notes are in fact now deemed to be in their private capacity and can be sued as such 70 what is it 70,000 um in lawful money gold or silver gold for punitive damages compensatory damage damages and for defamation of character right so never ever ever you go out there and say you're sorry sorry for what you've already served them right they now have to deal with the ramifications of their actions or their non-actions because silence is what you guys silence is what silence is agreement silence is acquiescence right so they've just agreed to everything so somebody shared with us a video yesterday of this agent holding up this sign and i was laughing and i was saying to them that sign that they're holding up holding up actually when you read it and understand what they're actually saying is they agreed to everything that you've put forth to them. They're now liable. They're now liable, not just um, in the, this, the, the lawful realm, but spiritually, they now have to give an account for their actions or their non-actions to the ethers, the gods, the angels. Mute laws, you guys, the universe kicks in. Do you understand what I'm saying? Because it's a divine and national movement, right? It's the it's divine and national movement. It's a divine and national movement, right? All right, that doesn't hurt so much when I talk. It's just difficult because the words don't always come. I'm just grateful that I have the ability to formulate words <laughs> because if I couldn't formulate words, that would have been, <laughs> been difficult. 
I've been there, you guys. So I'm grateful I can still formulate words. Grateful I still have some sense. But yeah, I was thinking about that yesterday. So I'm going to put this in the description below. But there's one thing I disagree with. He was saying that all this stuff has to stop. And I know we're going into the, um, I think it's a new Patriot Party or something, right? But I'm thinking that um, it might be a changeover. I don't necessarily see stopping because why? First of all, when this one was created, it was April 2nd, 2020. Since then, we've since, we've since learned that Donald Trump and everyone has gone over to Rome, the Vatican, and cleaned out that whole area. There was 650 plane loads of cash and all kinds of wonderful stuff that they brought back. And it's supposed to be in Fort Knox, or I don't think it's Fort Knox, but it might be somewhere safe, right? In addition to that, all the wealth of the wicked is being stored up for the righteous, right? So according to the executive order that we had read on this channel, or one of the other channels, might have been this one, um, Donald Trump had done an executive orders that it was war crimes against humanity. Anyone caught doing war crimes against humanity, their finances were going to be what, you guys? Think about it. So in lieu of what he's saying with this so-called debt, I don't even think that exists anymore. So I see it now as just a transition because when we first started, mm, they sent us this prophecy. Someone had prophesied we're looking into the future. I guess it's around this time. And they were saying they saw it as a smooth transition. They didn't actually see anything that was going to be an upheaval to cause any major confusion. That being said, they didn't mention masks, right? And one of the things he was talking about here was the Trail of Tears and the Jim Crow laws and all the corruption under the KKK Act. Now they call it mask, right? It's the same thing. You have to laugh, you guys, because if, you if you're going to cry. Yesterday it was reported to us there's plastic snow. Some people in the comments section said this plastic snow has been around for a really, really long time, apparently. So I was thinking, you know, when you're little, you're eating plastic, <laughs> eating plastic snow. Everybody used to eat snow, right? You got to laugh, you guys. So anyways, international authorities go and deal with that. Now, something else they reported to us yesterday. Is it Pakistan or somewhere in the Middle East? They're having difficulties. The agent over there doing business <laughs> governance changed the laws on the farmers, right? So the farmers used to go directly to the agent doing business governance for their, whatever their fees were for whatever product they had um, grown, right? Now the agent over there has changed it to now that the corporate heads, the private heads can go directly to the farmers and then work out whatever arrangement it, they want for their goods. Bad idea because you remember the story. I think we had reported that one about Africa. Africa had these private agents over there that was paying the people little or nothing for mining gold. While these people were risking their lives, they weren't even making enough to feed themselves, much less their families, right? So it's to shut that down. So international authorities shut it down now, have the farmers regain control of their products. 10,000 farmers committed suicide, you guys. 10,000 farmers committed suicide. 10,000 committed suicide, I guess, based on some of the stuff that these changes that are happening in Pakistan or wherever. So go now, remove the agent doing business governance over there, put someone in that's lawful in the people's territories that they choose, oh Lord, someone lawful in their areas that they can do um, commerce with and then remove those corporate private entities because we know so many of them are now stepping down for the very gen genocide and treason and charge up those ones in Pakistan and the ones in Africa, all those private European agents that were stealing the people's um, natural resources for little or nothing going around them up for treason and genocide and war crimes against humanity this night. Have the people be paid properly so that they can continue to farm, right? And not have to worry about feeding their families. Because what would happen, you guys, they'd be subject to extortion, right? Oh, Lord, don't laugh, you guys. All right, so just deal with that now so the people can be free and compensate the ones that are subjected to, oh, Lord, their families and then, yeah whoever committed suicide, compensate them. 
for their undue financial hardship and all the stuff that they were subjected to in this 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 war that we've been subjected to that we didn't even know it was it was a war we didn't know this war existed can you imagine you guys there's a war going on half people don't even know right? all right you guys so thank you for that um thank you in advance for your speedy response to that matter by noble honorable Ange, ellie nitty alfred l ruben i tribe chief American Indian, a loaded title, Morris American National, UCC 1-308, without recourse, all rights reserved. I stand by the Book of Ruth, by my deceased organ harvested husband and myself, Jackson. All right, so this federal federally recognized, so I was saying that a lot of these, our older videos, they had sent to us, um, I want to say a hub in these different organizations, right, who were handing out thousands and millions of these tribal groups <laughs> Meanwhile, the real tribes were sitting there, they got nothing. So I was saying, well, how dare they do that? It's not fair. Oh, boy. And then later, I, I made an affidavit to shut them down because it's not fair. All these years, you remember Donald Trump was in that interview, um, and he said, they don't look like Indians to me, <laughs> right? Oh my gosh, so here he's talking about the Indians being the, the American Indian, the, the blacks, the so-called, yeah. Oh, the Americans, sorry, the, the um, African Americans and the so-called blacks and what have you. And um, yeah. All right, so just deal with that on our behalf now. See to it, the proper people who are the original people get their... Um, yeah, whatever's in the trust or whatever they're supposed to get, send it to them now. Do that on our behalf. Oh, gosh. Have to laugh, you guys. I just find this hilarious because it's like at the stage of the game when you hear all this stuff, it's, you know, to make sense of it and put it into perspective, you know. F. Mark Men says yes. I forget which video this one is. Um, he was saying yes to. I have to click on it and find out. Um, this Macon... Macon Mills says, who were Adam and Eve? They're the mother and father of the human family, Asiatics and Muslim. I don't even know about the Adam and Eve story, guys. Because <laughs> when we found out that we were doing experiments with um, the monkeys and whatnot, I'm not sure about the Adam and Eve story now. I got to go back and ask the ancestors about that one. Um, Eris Banks said he's confused or he's lost. You got to go back to our videos and watch them to get more information so you're not so lost. All right. Divine wisdom and power of the seer said it's been like this for 8,500 years. And finally, we can move forward in the now space and correct syntax language. I didn't even understand the syntax language. I just I don't understand it, man. Oh, can you imagine people went to court talking about Syntax verb, adverb, didn't know what they're talking about, right? <laughs> Nobody knew because none of us were taught proper languages, right? Oh, boy, you guys do not go into court and <laughs> tell me you understand legalese. Yeah, you do not understand legalese. Tell them the truth. Speak plain, plain English. You don't understand it, right? Okay, Noble L. Russell J. Gould is responsible for the worldwide. I don't know about that, man. My ancestors, the elders here, keep telling us, no, he might think he's responsible for it, but he's not. There's a God, divine wisdom of this here. It's us, it's you, me, and whatever, right? Okay, Rain commented, ginger tea, yes, with honey and lemon. I forgot to get ginger. I didn't see any lemon. I don't even know if I have honey. Drink lots of water. Yes, I've been doing that. I've been drinking lots of coconut water. Um, thank you, Big Six. Take care. Yeah, man. Thank you for that rain. And then Seven Streams says, thank you, Noel. Thank you, um, Seven Streams. Oh, all right. Seven Streams, just keep the faith here. Um, Mercedes Dickinson said, it is advertised that it snowed in Jerusalem. Photos shown as their media is controlled. So it is what it is. Mercedes commented, um, Dickerson said, I'm reviewing and studying and your um, stick it to, I don't know, is loved. Angels are guided by all who are whole and not allowing liars, stealers, enforcers. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So funny. Um, 
and Mercedes Dickinson said above is above, so is below. Um, this is confirmed by nature. Yeah, it's notice the agent, notice the principal, notice the principals, notice the agent into all errors and assigns. You see, when I first did that quick claim deed and I told you guys I thought I was gonna do it for ten people, ten entities, and I did it for like three hundred, right? <laughs> Including all the media. <laughs> And the Pope and all the archbishops globally. I was mad. I was like, and did you do this? Did you commit human trafficking and all this stuff, right? That time I didn't have a clue that all this stuff was going to come out. Oh, boy. Just did it by faith, you guys, because faith without works is dead. All right. So when Trump is going to announce, when is Trump going to announce the end of mass? Only God in heaven knows. Until then, it's all actors. And did those poor released children wear a mask? Why no video? Too much, just in time. Um, thank you for all of you. And those who are going against Trump, I got none to say. If y'all can't see what's going on, right, and you want to stand on the side of evil, go ahead, I'll wait, I'll watch, right? Oh, thank you for all you keep doing. <laughs> Seven streams said he was broke down. I hope your car is better. Make sure it's okay now. Your automobile as well. Um, if you are not well, please rest. We have a long way to go, right? We need a mom, all right. Um, <laughs> I was just thinking, disabled disabled senior fighting for disabled seniors. Funny, I was listening to Robert Steele yesterday. Oh, man, Robert Steele made me laugh, boy. He was saying that people are just going to have to fight. These devils will continue to stoop as low as they can keep to keep control of the economic society. And, you know, I'm thinking something totally different is going down. Thank you for sharing. You brought us some good videos. Um, and, yeah, these guys are just, everybody's telling me all these amazing remedies. Um, we did a video on plastic snow in 2013. The snow in the U.S. has been made from plastic for years. And as you all know, the best weapon we have as humans is our minds. So we're supposed to put our minds together and just focus on all the corruption being melted, you guys. Okay. Um, and then they were talking about some obnoxious, obnoxious filing fees. Irvin Middleton here. And then Texas threatened to leave the union after the vote. After the vote certification. What a coincidence that they now are <laughs> freezing temperatures and massive snowfall. I was thinking about that, and I was thinking that they couldn't leave, and they were going to do some sedition or leave the the the, the main corporation, right? Secede from the, the union. They can't leave because it's why, you guys, it's Indian lands where they go, right? Unless they're going to go over and leave and go do some corruption. Where they go, and that doesn't make sense. Anyways, got to just look at you guys. I saw the dots of blue and snow in New York. My dog keeps trying to eat it. I don't know why. God bless you for fighting for everyone. Prayers to get better. It takes some turpentine to help. Yeah, but I've been rubbing with turpentine, turpentine and olive oil. Plastic snow, that's crazy. It just goes on. We're not getting notifications. Just keep checking in. We'll make the videos as they... We're guided. Gee, um... Let me see. Get behind me, all ye evil. We posted the declaration prayer. Hang on. Hang on a second. All right, so over to some real fake news. Let's see what's going on now. No, this is probably real, maybe. Let's see. Okay, December 2020. Alliance notes. Paul Zoomer. Stage one and two done. Stage number three. Vast advance by the... Alliance only with a few strongholds left, mainly being, I don't see these guys, this one. No, I, I'm feeling totally different. The ancestors telling us something totally different. Latest update, China CCP has been down. Iran and Israel unknown at this time. I don't get that. With Congress, and you guys have to use the spirit of discernment as you're getting this information, right? With Congress and most of the swamp in D.C. being arrested here in February, stage four. The massive under-earth war began many years ago underground with the call up of all branches of the U.S. military and 22 other alliance members. There are the galactic forces who make up 50% of the under-surface war. From recent intelligence, about 70% to 80% 
of the underground tunnels and dumb bases are all in Alliance hands. I'll wait for Gene Decode. Gene Decode's one very possible future playing out. Supreme Court hears. I don't even know about this. Like, I don't see the purpose of this part anymore. This the whole thing about the election. What's the purpose of it now? Because if if he's already won ninety percent, like I don't I don't know. President Trump invoked the Insurrection Act and had the right to protect the laws of the original Constitution of the United States the military is the latest is a last line of defense. Also has a right and obligation, same as the president, to protect, m- make sure the Constitution is followed. The U.S. Incorporated established in 1871 is now defunct and dissolved. The new republic with the original constitution was invoked on July 4th, 2020. Don't you guys find this funny that all this conspiracy theory stuff that we used to hear about all became true? Think about it, you guys. Announcements that C-19 has been gone for a long time and it was a part of the cabal's plan to take down all the world's economies, to wreck Trump's American economy so that they would win they could win the November 20, November 2020 election, and so they could use a chemical cocktail vaccine and no antibiotics, with no any with no antibodies in the solution to kill off many. What? What? Finally, to use more mail-in ballots to cheat this time. Okay, you guys can read that part. listen you guys Jeffrey Epstein is still alive and is singing like a canary in in the organization so he does not get executed (laughs) so you remember the last one that they wanted me to read I wouldn't read it about him right One of my helpers are here washing off the front of right. You want to talk about communication, language barriers, right? They ask for fab. You know what fab is, you guys? Laundry soap. No matter what kind of laundry soap, it's called fab. Right? Fab. Can I have some fab? Right? Anyway, so um, let me see if there's anything else to read here. And laugh, you guys. Find humor in life because you know what? I don't even see the point of anything else anymore. Learn to laugh. Laugh it off, you guys. Within one year, no more poverty, no more hunger, and everyone will have shelter. You better make sure the people have food now because within one year, if they don't have food now, they got a problem, right? (laughs) Within one year, all the oceans and real bad areas are cleaned up. God, I'm hoping so because I saw some decrepit areas this month and I was thinking, God in heaven, how are they going to find this one, (laughs) right? True history of the human race will be revealed. Really? <laughs> Real maths, physics, and science will be taught. And all books in school will be rewritten. Wow. All deep state and cabal removed from society within a year. Abundance on earth from for everyone. We will embrace our neighbors. I don't know about that. Not be afraid of our neighbors. I don't know about that one. As we conditioned before, as we were conditioned before. By the, unless you clean up some of those neighbors that are corrupt. I don't see that happening because we do have some corrupt neighbors, you guys. This is not our, our nature. We will be considerate to one another, not block hallways, um, be more polite, um, not cut off people on the highways. We will be happy and joyous in our everyday life. Everyone within one year will celebrate joy and happiness throughout the world. We will share with our galactic family and have peace um, throughout the galaxy. I say laughter. Just People just need to laugh, man. <sighs> Washington, D.C. will never be used again for the American government system. Most of U.S. Congress bills in past decades were to steal from the American people. Hollywood is done. It was a Luciferian center. Many a, a dr- Okay. Oh, my God. 
You guys can read that. Oh, wow. Disney will go out of bit. What? What? Read that, you guys. Denver Airport under Denver Airport. What is under Alliance Hands now for two years? Oh, my gosh. The current Western medical system will mo mostly be gone this year. The med beds are available. Send one to me now. They do not exist until they do not until you see the experience. They do not. I don't know about that. Send us one now. Bitcoin was created by the central banking system, deep state. Do not buy any Bitcoin. It will go down a lot. Do not part with your currency until official exchange. All right, you guys can read the rest of that. Wow, around 152 embassies closed in Washington, D.C. since January 20th, 2021. Holy crap. Afghanistan, Albania, Algeria, Angola. You guys can see the list here. Holy smokes, man. They all closed in Washington, D.C. Oh, my word. Jamaica's on there, you guys, yes. Netherlands. All right. So, whoa. Virologist exposes the C-19 fraud and sues CDC. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness, you guys. Read that. No one died from the M19. The testing and vaccine has already killed more people than the M19. Oh my goodness, you guys. Unfreaking believable. All right, you guys, like, share, subscribe. You guys have yourself a great day. Remember to support us here. Go to PayPal at themollies.gmail.com. For those of you in need of the GSA bonds to set off matters, you can email us here. You can also email us for the 1099 OID. You could join us on our Noble L. Um, <clears throat> our new channel here. I think I clicked on it so you guys can see it, right? You can get in touch with us as well on here. There's some of our videos you can watch it here, right? Plastic snow, oh my gosh. Yeah, and you can join our online email group or you can join us on our um, online tutor school class. It's a tutor class. You know why it's a tutor class, you guys? We were taught many moons ago, I think it was our Grand Sheik elder, um, Grand Sheik Taj Tariq Bey was explaining that all knowledge lies in the base of our spine, in the back of your neck, right at the base, the, the base of your spine there. And what we needed was someone to guide us, to bring it out, to bring clarity, and things start to pop up, the information starts to, to crop up that you already had inside of you. And you just needed, I call it tutoring, just someone to just say, Oh, and by the way, did you know that this happened in 1861? And then you start to put the pieces of the puzzle together because things start to make sense for the very first time. So it's not a school, it's a it's an online tutor school class, but it's not your typical, you know, graded. No, it's not about that. It's about bringing out the forefront of success and knowledge that you have in that inside of you and knowing what happened too, because history and law goes hand in hand, right? So you can email us for that. We're going to put the links in the description below. Remember to please, please support us here. And remember, <clears throat> there's something that came to me today, the scripture that talked about, do not put your pearls before swine. Do not put your pearls before swine. When we first started this journey and I found out we were who we were, I wanted to go on a mountaintop and just tell every so-called melanated um, black who they were and that, thinking that we're all the same not realizing we're not. So, um, yeah, just be careful when you're out there, right? And we tell Moors who are Moors, go to rvbaypublications.com um, to claim your correct status in your national, because they have records, you guys. They know who you are. They have to go to the Library of Congress, whatever, they got records, right? So you don't just up and willy-nilly create your own identification card. Um, faith without works is dead, right? And there was something that I wanted to say. There was a scripture that said, um, well, how does it go? I think it was something like, um, uh, if you have faith, 
I forget how it is now, but I'll, it'll come back to me. And then it was, um, let your light so shine before men, so they may see your good works and glorify the Father which is in heaven. Do unto others as, as you would have others do unto you. It is the law, Matthew 7, 12. Learn to laugh. You guys laugh it off, whatever it is. And also, see, my voice is coming and going. And then, um, what else? Yeah, peace to the gods, Psalms 82, 6. Who's the gods? You are, right? God lives inside of you. Heaven is, is on earth. Make your heaven on earth right now, you guys. And who is the earth, wind, stars, and the moon, the moors, the American Indians, the original indigenous people, right? The gods. Um, but there was one that I wanted to say about faith, and it slipped my mind. It'll come back to me. If I find the scripture, I'm going to put it in the description below. You guys like, share, subscribe. You guys have yourself a great day. And it's sunny and bright and beautiful here today. And just a wonderful day. And thank you to all of the people that showed up to help us this day. And again, we're so happy that I was able to put that entity in their place finally. Like, share, subscribe. You guys have yourself a great day.